And now the Asian Games kick off this Friday with thousands of athletes coming together in Incheon to compete. Even the KBO has gone on break until October to accommodate its players taking part as Korea aims for a great performance on its home turf. Song ji Sun has the preview of the Games. The Asian Games is Asia's biggest sports celebration. This year's 16-day event, being held in the South Korean port city of Incheon, will showcase the talents of some 10,000 athletes. North Korean athletes will be among them, and the first wave of their delegation arrived in the South last Thursday. But North Korean cheerleaders will not be making a trip. They were in hand for the Asian Games in Busan back in 2002, but are skipping this year's event after failing to reach an agreement with the South over their accommodations and expenses. Looking ahead to the competition, South Korea is aiming for a top two finish in the overall medal count for the fifth consecutive event with its eye on winning at least 90 golds. China has been a fixture atop the medal count dating all the way back to the 1982 games. Preliminaries for several sports kicked off over the weekend, and Team South Korea got off to a quick start. The men's football team beat Malaysia 3-0, and the women's squad trounced Thailand 5-0. If you want to catch some of the action in person, the organizing committee announced that only 20 percent of the overall tickets have been sold as of this Monday. Seats are also still available for Friday's opening ceremony, which starts at 6 p.m. For more information, visit Incheon2014AG.com. Song Ji-sun, Arirang News.